Hi, uh, I'm Ramesh. Uh, I'm from IST, and uh, I would like to show you how to set up your cluster account in this uh, for your uh, M Tech or B Tech uh, projects. Like, so here I have set up a virtual machine of Windows, and uh, you can see how to set up your cluster account. So you can to access your cluster account. Uh, you can use this software called uh, Move Extreme Home Edition and uh, you can download this installer edition and uh, it will download your file and uh, you can also use uh, WinSAP for uh, file transfers to and from clusters to your local account or uh, your uh, remote PC so I already downloaded the software and uh, you can install it uh, by double clicking it just accept and uh, it is basically a ssh uh, command and uh, it this software will give you a GUI to access this so we have installed move Team and we can also uh, install win scp so win scp is like uh, a protocol to uh, transfer uh, the files between your local machine and uh, your cluster so we can just finish this off and uh, you might have gotten your uh, user credentials user id and password uh, uh, from uh, the mdc and uh, to set up your uh, cluster account you can double click on mobile extreme this will take a minute and uh, So uh, click on allow. Uh, this will only ask you this one, the first time you're starting. So you can just uh, give a uh, like dark mode and uh, start local terminal. Uh, you can just go to session and uh, SSH. So remote host is the IP address you might have uh, gotten from the MDC. So mine is on um, 22.20.48.70 and uh, specify username is the uh, your username. Mine is Ramesh, you uh, leave the port as 22 and uh, click on OK. Just uh, accept it and uh, your password is, uh, you might have gotten the password don't worry it will not show the password while you are typing in the terminal so do you want to save password uh, you can click on yes and as well as uh, you can uh, note it down on a notepad this master password is for mobile extreme you can click uh, whatever you, you can type whatever the password you want to type and uh, uh, main thing is uh, you have to remember these so uh, this is the uh, it will ask you for uh, one more it will ask you for the password one more time when you open this like if I exit and uh, open it again and uh, this logs in because I have already done this but uh, if you are setting up for the first time it will uh, ask you for the password one more time and just put the password and uh, um, so this is the uh, home directory like uh, here you can go to your uh, directory and uh, mine is assigned to Luster so you double click on Luster scroll through it and uh, you can use your files so these are the simulations i am currently running so this is how you access this so basic commands for uh, the cluster is sque ue so this command gives you the how what are the jobs uh, simulations running in the cluster and who are the users and uh, so this is mine and uh, 
so you can also give s info to uh, check uh, whether the any nodes are available so 45 is uh, we only have uh, 50 nodes as the time of this recording and uh, uh, 45 is allocated and the uh, other five or some there might be some problem I, I don't know like so these are the basic commands you can open this uh, uh, folders as a window using this command uh, so it will open you this account and uh, I have already bookmarked my folders here or else you can go to other locations computers and uh, it will give you you can go to luster and uh, uh, this might uh, take a while because it is I am running it on my virtual machine so you can go to your folder and uh, you can also access this files like this so yeah so if you want to you can click ctrl c to terminate a command and uh, start a new command like so you can also use your once you have uh, uh, written these commands one time in the terminal you don't have to type it again and again you can just uh, click on up arrow and uh, show uh, the commands will come so uh, to download or upload a fo file from your local machine to your uh, folder uh, you can just go to the luster and uh, you can go to your respective folder and uh, you can click on upload this green button is for uploading and uh, maybe we can just try uploading this uh, uh, this image to the cluster you can this will upload yeah so same way if you want to download this like uh, i'm downloading the same file click on the file and uh, click on the blue button and it will ask for the location and you can give the location i'm just going to give this pictures and uh, download it it will download it will take it it will take some time so ideally you have to upload or download from the workstation you are assigned so that it uh, it uh, since it has a wired uh, uh, internet connection the connection will be faster so this is about uh, the mobile extreme i think i covered most of it um, so since this i find this way a bit uh, uh, clunky and uh, unreliable for downloading the folders so I use this uh, Win SCP so this is like uh, this is also a software to access this uh, folders I showed you earlier through mobile extreme so you can use this file protocol like SFTP or SCP I find SCP a little bit faster than SFTP that is what I read in the internet but uh, you can play around with it and uh, check what works for you uh, same way you can use the host name as 172 point uh, this is uh, your uh, mm, uh, ID so uh, this is this may not be the same for you so check with uh, MDC and uh, you may the mail you got from MDC and uh, you can enter your password you uh, entered through this uh, mobile extreme while you are logging in and you can just uh, save you can save it you can also create a, uh, a desktop shortcut and uh, it will open you automatically so you can give accept and uh, this is the same folder like 
Africa you uh, you s- saw during this uh, during uh, the mobo extreme session so you can like, go to the previous folders by clicking on this or else this route you can also go to cluster and uh, you can go to uh, where is my yeah so this this is here and uh, this left side pan is for uh, is your local machine so you can go to this desktop and you can just simply uh, this is my cluster and this is the local machine you can just uh, drag and drop here and it will ask for this um, i find it like transfer and background is somewhat useful and uh, you can play around with this and uh, check what works for you if you want to change something so you can click on okay and uh, uh, it is nothing like so yeah this is transfer here so same way you can just uh, upload also so you can basically maybe you if you want to uh, check a file maybe i will uh, test.txt mm, hi uh, this is a test so i will save this in here so uh, you can uh, learn the shortcuts while using it F, uh, the f7 key will give you uh, the option to is a shortcut to uh, create new files or folders in this uh, win sap so you can just uh, uh, here drag it from here and put it on here it will uh, it is completed so it is just a text file on kb so it is faster so uh, it is in cluster so you can check with this and uh, yeah this is not the only way to access your cluster this is the same way like uh, you can uh, you can do no or uh, uh, since i have already saved my workspace you can just uh, uh, click on this so if you open this uh, id uh, ramesh at 172 uh, your user id uh, it will directly open to your cluster you don't have to put any passwords since we already saved uh, the passwords so it will, it will be automatically saved so these are the links i will put this in the description and uh, these are the websites so this is not the only way to access it like you can also use your uh, general uh, terminal to uh, access this so you can go to powershell and run this administrator and uh, you can just uh, click ssh ramesh at uh, 72 point okay so uh, since this is a virtual machine i couldn't uh, open it maybe i can try it on my uh, normal machine so you can open your terminal with powershell as an administrator and uh, use ssh uh, ramesh at 0 0.48.70 it, uh, it will uh, if you're doing it first time you have to uh, s- uh, type yes and click on enter it will ask for some permissions so you can just uh, uh, type in your password mm, you will get the same window so it is it is the same thing uh, so like uh, whatever uh, you can do here or you can do it with uh, mobile extreme as well so yeah that's it if you have any questions so uh, don't comment just ask your seniors or uh, chat gpt it bye